Hi, I'm John with Rigid. Today we're going to go over how to change the dies on an 811A universal machine die head. So on your 811A die head, you will see on the back side, on the back plate, where it says change dies and it has an arrow. And you can see that plate moves. That's actually called the cam plate. You want to make sure to move it all the way over to the side. But if you take a look at it here, you've got a washer with a tongue on it that prevents it from sliding all the way over. Now, whenever you change the dies, you want the die head to lie flat with the numbers facing up. You want to make sure that this throw out lever is all the way in the open position. Now, when you loosen your screw on top, what you're going to do is take that washer out with the tongue. Now you're gonna push the two halves of the die head all the way to the end. At that point, your dies now can slide right out of the die head. At this point, you're gonna put your replacement dies in. You're gonna match the numbers and the insert to line to the edge of the casting of the die head. You're gonna take your dies, corresponding number to the corresponding pocket, slide them in until it gets to the edge of that line on the outside of the housing of the casting of the die head. And next one, your number two will go in, and then we'll put the number one in, insert to line, and then your last number four to the insert to line. A lot of people try to push the two halves of the die head. You can do it that way. I found it so much easier to use the throw out lever and just slide that until it captures the dies. Then you can slide it over and your washer will then drop back into the slot on the die head itself. Then you tighten the clamp screw and you're ready to go install it on the machine and use it.